Hey fruits and vegetables, welcome back. I'm Banana Peel, and in this episode, we are going to be doing the 40, uh, 47 ascending colon. So yes, let's just evolve our power to Chun, which is uh, looking like it has three lactobacillus on it, but I don't think it has because the other two, you know, don't have teeth, and you know, they don't have uh, cheeks. Why does this lactobacillus have cheeks? I have no idea. Anyway. Yep, let's keep upgrading him, let's keep upgrading him, let's go. Another one, and another one, and another one. Come on, almost there, Chun. Hopefully we can make it. <laughs> it's taking so long to just upgrade these guys, right? Yeah, I'm really eager to read about this guy because does he have three lactobacillus or not? Or is he a single lactobacillus? We're about to find out, so yes. Finally, we have finally evolved him. The lactobacillus has become fat. Ah, come on. Don't do that. So sad. The lactobacillus has once more divided into three clusters. Unlike before, however, it has formed into one big legged lactobacillus. In the middle with two smaller lactobacilli are joined on either side. Yes, finally. This is the only lactobacillus we have come across which has three lactobacillus in one lactobacillus <laughs> yeah resembling as a whole the traditional hairstyle of chinese women as the lactobacillus scientific name is lactobacillus chun li i will call it chun for short okay okay nice one oh the three lactobacillus continues yep let's just go on we are in the the camping thing right yeah ascending colon camping thing and let's just get into it not the cash no thank you yep there you go that's good let's go Yes, we have done it. We have got the gold medal as well. This level was pretty challenging. So, yep. Took me quite a bit, but once I mastered it, I got a gold. So, that's good. So, yeah. Okay, nice one. We still have a shield remaining. That's insane, actually. I was really not hoping for the shield to still remain, but good. Let's go. Okay. 48 ascending goal on Midsummer Night's Forest. Okay, okay, what is this? A Midsummer Night Forest? I have no idea what to say. 
I don't know what a midnight summer forest is, but I'm sure it doesn't look like this. Okay, yeah, what are those black things? Probably something that wants to kill me. So, yep, we are doing fine. I'm really hoping for the next episode because I like the Lactobacillus because it looks pretty cool. And this is a really bad level because the villi is camouflaging with the background, so it's pretty hard to see. But yes, we are still alive and that's good for us. Let's go. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. That's a big boundary of jellyfishes. Okay, yep. Once you lose the rhythm, it's all gone. Yeah. Once you lose the rhythm, it's very difficult to get it back. So, yep. And we are dead. Not bad, not bad. At least we got a gold, right? Let's go on home. Let's go. Yes, yes, yes. Here's to becoming a true alchemist. Okay, oh, that's over. The country home where I spent my childhood was flanked by a thick forest, which became both my playground and the origins of my boundless curiosity. As soon as the weather became warm enough, I used to take some rag clothes and wooden sticks to build a tent in the forest. Safely nested within my tent, the forest at night seemed even more mysterious, adorned with beautiful stars scattered across the sky, the deepened shadows of trees that pulsed with near mystical vitality. I love that forest for all its infinite wonders and secrets of life. Okay, seems like the scientist is, you know, telling about this childhood and stuff like that. So yeah, cool. Okay, let's just collect our achievements and yep. Let's just check out our gold medal right here. 47 ascending colon. Give it to me. Thank you very much. Okay, that was it for this episode and I will see you guys on the next one. Bye-bye.